Hello and welcome to the session. I am Deepika here. Let's discuss a question which says integrate the following function x sin x. Let us first understand integration by parts. Now this method is quite useful in integrating products of functions. Now if we have to integrate two functions say fx and gx then the integral of fx gx is equal to, let us take fx as a first function and gx as a second function. So this is equal to first function that is fx into integral of the second function that is integral of gx minus integral of Differential coefficient of the first function that is f dash x into integral of the second function that is integral of gx So this is the key idea behind that question We will take the help of this key idea to solve the above question. So let's start the solution. Now we have to integrate x sin x. Let us take x as a first function. Usually if any function is a power of x or a polynomial in x, then we take it as the first function. So according to our key idea, integral of x sin x is equal to first function that is x into integral of the second function that is integral of sin x dx minus integral of differential coefficient of the first function that is d by dx of x into integral of the second function. Now we know that the process of differentiation and integration are inverses of each other and Derivative of cos x is minus sin x, so the integral of sin x is minus cos x. So we have integral of x sin x is equal to x into minus cos x minus integral of, now d by dx of x is 1 into integral of sin x is minus cos x. And this is equal to minus x cos x plus integral of cos x. And again this is equal to minus x cos x plus sin x because integral of cos x is sin x plus c. Hence answer for the above question is minus x cos x plus sin x plus c. I hope the solution is clear to you. Bye and take care.